Hi guys, Marcus here and welcome to the Chinese Entertainment Update, May 3rd, 2020. I release episodes every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday, and this is episode 224. Now because I use Chinese names quite a bit on my show, if you want the English spelling of them, click CC for English subs. I create them myself. In this episode, Yang Mi and William Chen begin filming Novoland Pearl Eclipse and the top 10 Chinese dramas and actors at the moment. But first, a quick reminder of what's premiered in recent days. Beautiful Reborn Flower is a modern drama starring Sun Weilong and Jelly Lin and it premiered on May 1st. It follows a famous curator who bumps into a woman who looks exactly like the woman he had loved for years. The drama is available on YouTube with English subs. The Enchanting Phantom is a ghost movie starring Chen Xingxu and Eleanor Lee and it premiered on May 1st. It follows a timid debt collector who meets and falls in love with a gorgeous young maiden who turns out to be a ghost. The movie is available on YouTube with English subs. Intense Love is a modern drama starring Zhang Yuxi and Ryan Ding and it premiered on May 2nd. It tells the story of an ingenious doctor and a beautiful actress who refuse their arranged marriage, yet realize that their love is destined. The drama is available on YouTube on MGTV Drama, no English subs at the moment. And now an update on Yang Zi and Deng Lun. This one's for all you fans of the two stars of Ashes of Love. They recently teamed up not for a drama, but for a Pepsi commercial. The picture is retaken by Chinese visual artist Chen Man. She wanted to show different sides of Yang Zi and Deng Lun. According to Chen Man, we would see lively and even wacky sides of the two stars. Yang Zi and Deng Lun recently became spokespersons for Pepsi in China. Those posters were a promotion for a limited edition Osmanthus flavored Pepsi. For those of you wondering, Osmanthus is also used to make tea in China. And speaking of Yang Zi, we now have a glimpse of her on the set of her new drama, The Golden Hairpin. The footage was taken and uploaded on social media on May 1st. It showed her entering her trailer in regular clothes and exiting in a pink costume. The Golden Hairpin also stars Chris Wu and they resumed filming after taking a hiatus due to the pandemic. And speaking of Chris Wu, he recently released a new EP. So I haven't done updates on Chris Wu that much. I don't know why, he's a huge star. He's got movies and music, and he's Canadian just like me. Maybe just because he hasn't done any dramas until recently. But before that, he starred in some pretty big Chinese movies. The ones that stand out to me are Mr. Six and Journey to the West, The Demons Strike Back. On April 22nd, he released a new EP record entitled Testing, and it became an instant hit. The record includes one English and three Chinese songs, and pre-sales surpassed 1 million units within 87 minutes on QQ Music. Chris wrote, composed, and produced the three Chinese songs, and had a part in composing the English song entitled Throwback. Recently, Chris appeared on Chinese influencer Via's livestream. There's the finger heart that we spoke about in my last video. Via is one of China's top livestream celebrities who once moved $30 million worth of product within four and a half hours on one of her live streams. Chris went on her live stream to exchange pleasantries and have a big bowl of noodles. Two gigantic stars in one live stream. I wonder how much worth of product they could move if they tried. And more first glimpses of actors on set. Novel and Pearl Eclipse officially began filming earlier today, and video clips and pictures of Yang Mi and William Chan have hit social media. Yang Mi was pictured in a black t-shirt and a light blue jacket with a matching mask. She stepped out of the hotel with her crew and immediately drew a crowd of fans and paparazzi alike. Later, she got into full costume, a sleek black outfit. William Chan was pictured in a black tracksuit and orange toque. Then he slipped on a flowing wig and then his white costume as well, as he too headed to set. I did a video back in January which speculated as to who would play the male lead in Novoland Pearl Eclipse. At that time, it wasn't confirmed yet. The candidates included Hu Ge to Deng Lun to Huang Xiaoming, but now it's clear that William Chan is the man. This is not the first time Yang Mi and William Chan worked together on a drama. They were both in Swords of Legends back in 2014, but the two main leads in that were Li Yifeng and Yang Mi. William hasn't been super active for a while now in terms of dramas and movies. In fact, he didn't have anything come out in all of 2019. He made some appearances on Chinese variety shows, 
One of those included the ill fated episode of Chase Me, where we lost Godfrey Gao. His last drama to air was Age of Legends in 2018 with Sandra Ma, and he has Dancing in the Storm with Guli Naja still waiting release. Novaland Pearl Eclipse follows a young mermaid played by Yang Mi. After her tribe is massacred during her enemy's search for a magical pearl, she flees and disguises herself to enter the Imperial Court. While there, she gets involved in a love triangle, and the rumored second lead is Xu Kai Cheng, who was recently in Well Intended Love 2. And it's Sunday today, so time for the top 10 Chinese dramas and actors at the moment, edition 18, May 3rd, 2020. The data is provided by V-Linkage, a marketing consultant company based in Shanghai. The list is based on view counts on Tencent, Aichi, and Yuku, social media discussions, and Baidu searches. We begin with the top 10 web dramas. Number 10, The Love Equations. The modern drama stars Simon Gong and Liu Renyu. Number 9, Love of Thousand Years. The costume drama stars Zhao Rusi and Zheng Yecheng. Number 8, Intense Love. The modern drama stars Zhang Yuxi and Ryan Ding. Number 7, Closer to You. The modern drama stars Li Yinan and Sabrina Chuang. Number 6, My Roommate is a Detective. The Republican era drama stars Hu Yitian and Leon Zhang. Number 5, Winter Begonia. The Republican era drama stars Huang Xiaoming and Andrew Yin. Number 4, Beautiful Reborn Flower. The modern drama stars Song Weilong and Jelly Lin. Number 3, The Lost Caverns. The modern drama stars Pan Yueming and Kitty Zhang. Number 2, The Best of You in My Mind. The modern drama stars Gala Zhang and Irene Song. And number 1, Legend of Awakening. The costume drama stars Arthur Chen and Dylan Xiong. Lots of new dramas making the list, modern romances as well like The Love Equations, Intense Love, and Beautiful Reborn Flower, but it is the fantasy costume drama Legend of Awakening that remains champ. And now the top 10 Chinese TV dramas at the moment. These are based on TV ratings and social media discussions in China, and they include reruns. Number 10, As Long As You Love Me, the modern drama stars Dylan Xiong and Lai Yumeng. Number 9, My Brother, My Sister-in-Law, the modern drama stars Wang Ting and Wang Yajie. Number 8, I Will Find You a Better Home, the modern drama stars Sun Li and Luo Jing. Number 7, A Hawthorne Tree Far Away, the modern drama stars Wu Qijiang and Ma Li. Number 6, Realize Our Dreams, the modern drama stars Xia Yang and Song Yunhao. Number 5, If Time Flows Back, the modern drama stars Jing Dong and Rulu Jiang. Number 4, Horizon Homeland, the modern drama stars Lin Xiaosu and Chuo Ni. Number 3, Skate Into Love, the modern drama stars Janice Wu and Steven Zhang. Number 2, Serenade of Peaceful Joy, the costume drama stars Wang Kai and Maggie Jiang. And number 1, Hunting, the modern drama stars Wang Kai and Angel Wang. Contrary to the web dramas list, the TV dramas list doesn't change much. Wang Kai's two dramas remain top two. And now the top 10 Chinese drama actors at the moment. These are based on drama performances, social media discussions, and Baidu searches. And on this list, there's no separation between web and TV. It's just drama actors as a whole. Number 10, Irene Song. She currently stars in The Best of You in My Mind with Gala Zhang. Number 9, Liu Yijun. He currently stars in Hunting with Wang Kai. Number 8, Del Raba. She recently starred in Eternal Love of Dream with Van Gogh Gao. Number 7, Angel Wang. She currently stars in Hunting with Wang Kai. Number 6, Yang Zi. She is currently filming The Golden Hairpin with Chris Wu. Number 5, Leon Zhang. He recently starred in My Roommate as a Detective with Hu Yitian. Number 4, Zhu Yilong. He recently started filming The Rebel with Tong Yao. Number 3, Wang Yibo. He recently wrapped filming Legend of Fei with Xiao Li Ying. Number 2, Xiao Zhan. He recently released his newest single, Spot of Light. And number one, Wang Kai. He currently stars in Hunting and Serenade of Peaceful Joy. Not much change from last week on this list as well. Irene Song and surprisingly Liu Yijun make the list, but it is Wang Kai, Xiao Zhan, and Wang Yibo who continue to fill the top three. So there it is, guys. Hope this gives you an idea of who and what drama's hot in Chinese drama land at the moment. And that's it for this episode. This show would not be possible without your support, so I thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, do subscribe and hit that notification button for more updates. 
If you'd like to contribute, check out my Patreon page, where for a dollar or more a month, I'll answer one of your questions at the end of one of my episodes. So stay safe, and as always, I wish you clear blue skies, good health, and happiness. Until next time, cheers! Oh,